just uh, really proud of this team. Uh, we've been uh, through really tough games the entire year. Uh, so um, this was not anything new for us. Uh, we pride ourselves on our defense, and I'm, I'm really proud of uh, our defensive effort. Uh, they were paying attention to the details. This is a time of the year where every single every single thing counts. Uh, the scouting report, uh, you know, free throws, and so I did that. I thought they did a magnificent job in the scouting report in guarding a very tough Furman team. Uh, we had um, uh, uh, five people. Oh yeah, yeah, four people in double figures. Antoinette is uh, has been one who's come off the bench and has given us great minutes. She adds to what we know that we do well. Uh, we offensive rebounds, we get opportunities, and I'm really proud of her. Uh, Yaya is just a tremendous uh, defensive uh, player, and this is nothing new uh, for her one year with us. Uh, she was the defensive player year last year, so. We are so proud of our overall team effort and our ability to handle that run. It's ebb and flow. We know it's going to be ebb and flow. No one is going to uh, give up. And so uh, Furman made a run. We handled the run, was able to capitalize. Uh, questions from the room. We have a mic. Uh, if you have a question, just raise your hand. Coach, if you can't talk a little bit, uh, just a stat that jumped out. Uh, despite 20 turnovers, you, you played, you, you went. Uh, 20 turns versus five. But if you look at the other points in the paint, a, a huge margin there for you, second chance points. Just talk a little bit about that, overcoming maybe those turnovers too. Is my stat sheet not correct? I see eight turnovers for us. I am looking and at 14, I'm sorry, points yeah. off turnovers being a good okay. thing for you. I'm sorry. Yeah, because one of yeah. Sorry, I'm, I, I was trying to say something else. I get it. Points so, off turnovers. So one of our team goals is we do really good with ball security. Like we're one of the top teams in the country in taking care of the ball, assist to turnover ratio. Our goal is under 12 a game. We had eight. We had eight tonight. Yeah. And we, we, we do a good job of forcing turnovers. Um, a stat that really sticks out is the fact that we have 14 assists uh, uh, you know, to eight turnovers. So we did take care of the ball and we forced 14 turnovers. Is that what you were? Yes, talking? that's what I was trying to say. Yeah, so <laughs> when, we, when we're able to turn uh, turn people over, we have speed on the wings. And, and so like um, the turnovers with Yaya, her, she's lightning quick with the ball. She's able to get from one end to the other in three seconds or less. Or less. And so that's what happens when they cause the turnovers. Other questions for the room? And can you talk about your experience from playing last year to this year and you know how much you know you had such great success tonight? Talk about that for me. Yeah, um, so just last year I just grew as a player. Uh, I knew my coaches and my teammates had trust in me. I know I have a disadvantage in the first, so as long as I know that my coaches and my teammates have faith in me, when I go in I know that that's all that I, that's all that I care about, that they have trust in me so that I can have trust in myself, which helps me. Obviously, one year here, but how did four years help you, you know, and and help lead this team tonight? It's a great question. I think that just learning as like a freshman through my senior year how to like deal with the runs and like deal with the um, like comebacks and like my transitional time as like a point guard because I wasn't always a point guard, but like my coach last year pointed me to be point guard and like just going through that whole thing. I think just learning from the cycles, being behind great point. Coach, I just wanted to uh, ask you, what was your main goal to take Jada and Tate and also uh, City Run out of the game, basically? Uh, though Tate did have some uh, scores, you was able to uh, keep our, the, the bigs out of, uh, out of the game, pretty much. Well, we, they're really very talented players, and what we needed to do is we wanted to take away the three-point game. Uh, but they also like to post up. And so we were able to get out on the wings and take away the early hits, the transition threes. So that part, we sort of eliminated that. And then the second flow of their offense, after they, they don't get that early strike, the second flow of their offense is they like to post up. So we were able to, we were working on that all week with our, 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 our guards, uh, fronting their guards. 
And uh, I think, you know, Tate is a very good player, and we had to go over her in ball screens and manage that uh, middle ball screen action. I thought that uh, the combination of the guards and the post did a great job with that. More questions? Hey, Coach, if you can just talk about next game preparations and kind of getting ready for an opponent you don't know who you have, but just keep ready for that. Absolutely. You know, we're just going to we're going to do us and uh, pay attention to the things that we do well. Uh, we'll watch a lot of film and we have less than uh, 24 hours to get ready. But I'm sure we're going to be ready for a great game on day two. Coach Antoinette and Ayanna, thank you so much for being here.